movies. They're able to make us laugh and cry. The players today we were highlighting have all made an appearance on the silver screen. Some of these basketball stars may have had short moments that we may have forgotten, and some other players, well, they'll go down as classics. Today's challenge is players who are in movies. That's right, players who were in movies. Now, some of these players just had small cameos, some were stars. Either way, we found 13 players out here that have all been on the silver screen. Up first, our starting point guard, and I want to point out my only point guard, Muggsy Bogues, one of the smallest people to play the game at 5'3". He's pretty tiny. We're fine. It's just some psychosomatic deal or something to do with the moon or the lime on the planet. After little Muggsy, we got Ray Allen out here. That's right, Ray Ray, or as some of my viewers call him, Way Allen. Way Allen, use Way Allen, Way Allen. We're gonna use Way Allen. 85 overall, this guy was in He Got Game and Harvard Man, and he likes to shoot threes. After Ray Ray, we got ourselves Michael Jordan, Defensive Player of the Year from 1988. 95 overall? Have you heard of this guy before? He's pretty famous. You might have seen him in a movie called, I don't know, Space Jam? After Michael, we have one of his teammates out here. That's right, Dennis Rodman, the worm from 1996 and 85 overall. Very uh, interesting individual, we'll say. He's known for being in the movie Double Team and wearing female dresses. What the fuck was that? And after Dennis, we got ourselves the Diesel out here. That is right, Shaquille O'Neal from 2006, 89 overall. This is a big, big man, and he starred in tons of movies. You might know him from Kazam. Steel! Even Freddy got fingered. Freddy, would you like some sausages? Freddy, would you like some sausage? And that is our starting lineup. Let's show you what we got on the bench here. We got another game reward. That's right, it's Pat Patrick Ewing from 1990, the big center, 93 overall. Some of you guys will recognize him from Space Jam, but hey, he was also in The Exorcist. After Big Pat, we got a guy out here called LeBron James. I don't know if you've heard of him. Okay, that joke's getting old. Anyway, he's an Amethyst, 94 overall. You might know him from the recent movie with Amy Schumer called Trainwreck. Hey, I guess he's going to be in the new Space Jam movie as well. Was Kobe busy? Aww. After Mr. James, we got a very, very large man out here. George Mersan from 1996. He is a center, 83 overall, formerly on the Wizards. As you know, George is incredibly tall. Seven foot seven, I might just add. So, of course, the guy with his stature would star in a movie called My Giants. I'm too tall, Sammy. I could put you in the movies. Following George, we got ourselves all Rick Fox out here. He's Canadian. Won't play for the Canadian team, though. We'll talk about that later. Anyway, 77 overall, a former Laker. This guy has starred in every single movie ever made. Okay, that's a bit of an exaggeration, but he's been in a lot. I'm not even going to get into it. You can look at imdb.com for that. After Mr. Fox, we got a guy called Kevin Durant, the Durantula. Have you heard of him? Currently playing for the Thunder. He's going to be a Laker next season. Mark my words. Fingers crossed. Kevin's been in just a few movies shown here, Back for the Future, but more notably, the star of the kids' film, Thunderstruck. What is wrong with Kevin Durant? Are you guys watching the same thing I'm watching? You're terrible. Dude can't even make a free throw. Well, you've been working with him, haven't you, big fella? <laughs> After Kevin, we got ourselves John Sally out here from 1996. Fortunately, he's only a bronze 66 overall, but thankfully he's been in a lot of movies, so he qualifies. This guy played in the Bad Boy era in Detroit, and actually he was in Bad Boys the Movie. That's pretty awesome. And look who it is. We got ourselves Larry Legend, the man with the moonshot, 1985. The only diamond out here, 97 overall. This guy is so good at shooting. I love Larry. He was in Space Jam and also a movie called Blue Chips. Can't jump. Bad back. Pathetic. How's it going, Pete? I'm doing good, Larry. And last but not least, on the bench, we got a man out here. I know you all have heard about him. He likes to dunk. It's Dr. J. Julia serving from 1985 and 88 overall. The doctor himself has been in quite a few movies. I actually even saw him on The Office, but more notably, The Fish That Saved Pittsburgh. Oh, well. 
That movie's trippy. And as always, we play a random subscriber in the stream. This guy's name is Frankie, not Frankie McDonald. He got Paul Gasol. I haven't seen that card before. Okay. Chris Mullin versus Michael Jordan. I think I got you beat on that one, Frankie. What else we got here? Anthony Davis taking on Dennis. Okay, I'll give you that one, but it's close. It's pretty close. Let's see what we got in the backcourt. We have Sean Livingston. What are you working with? Is this a team of game rewards? And then we got Shannon Brown. This is a team of game rewards. What the heavens is this? He got Cozy, got Kyrie, LeBron, JaVel. What is this? I'm so confused what kind of team you're running. Anyway, good luck. And here we go. I am the home team. Now, I can't figure out what kind of theme this team has. I, I It's just weird. Very weird with that Sean Livingston out there. Anyway, let's not get distracted. Focus on what we're doing here. Come on, Shaq. That's only little Paul Gasol. Pow block. And I jumped too early. I jumped too I wasn't focused. Get in there, Shaq. Shaq, Shaq. Ah! It's too slow. It's not good. <laughs> oh, my God. I forgot we had little Muggsy Bogues out here. Oh, he's so tiny. Shaq. Shaq. No way. Yes. Bring it down. Michael, Michael, Michael. Get that block, Muggsy. Yes. Muggsy's defensive pressure. Ray's cherry picking. Catch it, Ray. Catch it. What the hell was that? Okay, wait a minute. It's a very awkward team we have out here. Uh, maybe we should just get this to Michael Jordan and call it a day. Huh? Isolation. Michael. Oh, uh, oh. Uh. Michael. Oh, oh, oh. Faking it. Pass out, pass out, pass out. Why is Dennis chilling out the three-point line? You don't do that. You don't get down like that, Dennis. Oh, that guy does. Faking. Oh, oh. In the corner. Come on, Ray. Ah, that's okay. We got the rebound. We got the rebound. Shaq. Shaq. Get the fucking... The, the, the fucking Muggsy? Let's go, Muggsy. We got LeBron James at point guard. Yeah, we got to do it. I got to do it, man. Ray Allen. Faking it. Faking it. Ray, Ray. Ray, Ray. Oh, uh, we cannot get Ray open. He will not get open at all for me. Who's that? Jordan? Ah, oh, he don't shoot threes. Get in there, Jordan. Jordan. Yes. Thank you. Yoink, Come again. yoink, yoink, yoink. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. To Larry Legend. Larry Legendary. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Le oh, Le oh. Oh, is that Pat? Patrick Ewan trying to guard him? Patrick. Larry. Get in there. To my... To LeBron, LeBron, faking it, and making it. Grant at the point guard position, why not, right? Some people put him a power for it's the same thing, right? Get that block, get that block. How the fuck are you making these shots? Stay with him. Get, get that Durantula. No, no, how do you get that? No way. Oh my fucking shit, you can't miss. To Kevin Durant. All right, Kevin, feeling good. Get in there, Kevin. Durant, he's the only guy doing it for me. Let's go, let's go, let's go. No way. Oh my god, he made another one! He hasn't missed! Danny, stay with him, stay with him. No way, no way! Bruh. Dude! It's bad, it becomes worse. Finally! Oh, we got it, he gets it back! Game! I'll go working my way for a minute, just for a minute. Come on, come on, get that! What are you doing, Muggsy? He ran into the stupid ball! That what the hell? The ball went through me! That's right, you give me that back, game. You give me that back. I feel bad. I feel real bad. Uh, uh. Pass out. Pass out. Oh, my God. Ray, Ray, wide open. Really? Come on. Kevin Durant. Kevin Durant. Uh. Little step back. Little step. Step back. Oh, my God. He's leaving me open. I'm wide open. An A minus. I missed an A minus wide open with two rings around me. 2K. 2K, man. Just let me be open. Watch me miss an open look. Look, he's leaving me wide open. He knows. He knows. Look. Wow. You gotta be fucking shitting me, 2K. And then the guy gets... What? What? Wide open, Larry Bird. It went in? I didn't think that could happen. The way we shot this game was pathetic. He shot amazing. I don't know what happened. Oh, there'll be an angry letter to 2K on this one. Sweet Jesus, you movie stars. I feel bad for you. You're not gonna be casting anything after this. It's not even how some of my players did. It's how good the other team was able to shoot. Like Kevin Durant, 12 minutes, 18 points. Eight for 12, not too bad. Michael Jordan, four for six, 11 points. Muggsy, I don't even know why you're on the team, but Larry Bird, uh, only five points, two for four though. Dr. J was perfect. Oh, this guy. LeBron, one for six. Really? Shaq, one for four? Ray Allen, one for six? 
George, you were perfect. He shot 73%. And I just want to point out, he was taking some crazy shots near the end because he knew he had this in the bag. That is amazing. I shot 49%. Maybe I got a little frustrated at the end, but either way, I still think that could have been a little bit higher, 2K. A lot of those were open looks. Offensive rebounds, we both had three. He killed me on defensive rebounds, 18 to 10. We both had three steals. I had four blocks to his three, but yet he beat me by 17 points. One of my worst shooting performances compared to one of the best we've seen. Ugh, GG. Guys, thank you for watching, and as always, keep your stick on the ice.